Hi guys and welcome to Strength Universe. Before we start, I'd like to thank everyone who requested a video on The Big Show and point out that this video contains no material owned by the WWE or its affiliates. The Big Show, aka Paul White, was born on the 8th of February 1972 in Aking, South Carolina. He was born with a condition called giantism due to a tumour on his pituitary gland causing the release of excessive growth hormone, which would later become acromegaly. By the time White was 12 years old, he was already 6 foot 2 inches tall and weighed 220 pounds. And just over two years later, he'd reached 6 foot 8 inches tall. During his time at high school, White played basketball for the Knights at the W. Wyman King Academy in South Carolina, where he earned all-class honours in his junior and senior years, plus all-conference honours for three years. Following high school, White attended the Northern Oklahoma Junior College in Tonkawa, where he earned all-conference honours. In 1991, he attended Wichita State University, where at 19 years old, White had reached 7 foot 1 inches tall and weighed 325 pounds. And it was while at Wichita that he started to use the sponsor of today's video, ExpressVPN, preventing his internet service provider from tracking his activity by rerouting network traffic through the ExpressVPN secure and encrypted servers. One of the best features is the ability to set your location in one of 94 countries, allowing you to watch your favourite programmes from streaming services while travelling overseas, or saving you money by booking flights and hotels at that country's local price. But why choose ExpressVPN? Well, for a start, they only use premium servers, making them consistently faster and more reliable. They provide 24-7 customer support, providing you with answers in seconds, not hours, and are rated as the best VPN provider by tech sites including CNET, The Verge, TechRadar, and many more. So if you want to start benefiting from using the number one rated VPN provider, click my link in the description to sign up to ExpressVPN today and get three months free. White would only stay at Wichita for a year before changing to Southern Illinois University, where he was a member of the National Collegiate Athletic Association Division II Cougars basketball team. White finished his time at Southern Illinois in 1993, and shortly afterwards underwent surgery on his pituitary gland, which halted his growth although by this stage he was already a giant, wearing a shoe size 22, ring size 22, and a chest of 62 inches. Following his surgery, White worked in various jobs including being a bouncer, bounty hunter and working at a karaoke company. It was while doing the latter that he would meet Danny Bonaducci in a live microphone amateur contest on his morning radio show. Bonaducci later introduced White to his friend Hulk Hogan, with whom he played basketball as part of a world championship wrestling promotion. Hogan liked how White worked the crowd and recommended him to WCW's vice president Eric Bischoff. In 1995, White signed with the WCW and debuted in May, where he was billed as the son of Andre the Giant, and accordingly used the ring name The Giant. The following year, White made his acting debut in the budget picture Reggie's Prayer. He went on to appear in his first mainstream movie later that year as Huge Santa in the Arnold Schwarzenegger comedy Jingle All The Way. He wrestled for WCW until 1999, when he signed a 10-year contract with the WWF on the 9th of February, where he initially appeared under his real name before later making his WrestleMania debut as The Big Show. In the summer of 1998, White was involved in an altercation with Robert Sayer at a Marriott hotel. White stated that Sayer had been verbally abusive, threatening and shoved him, and he had responded with a single punch that broke the victim's jaw. White was later charged with assault, but after three days of deliberation, the judge delivered a verdict of not guilty. The Big Show continued his career with the WWE after it acquired the WWF in 2002. During this time, he was built at a height of 7 foot 2 inches and had a peak weight of 537 pounds. However, according to Paul, his actual height was 7 feet tall. Well, I've always been a little over 7 foot. Uh, at one time in WWE, I weighed 537. It would be during his first stint at the WWE that Big Show claimed to bench press 227 kilograms or 500 pounds for a staggering 12 repetitions. Such a weight for this number of reps matches the personal record of Larry Wheels, who has a one rep max of 295 kilograms 
or £650. However, more on this later in the video. Wright left the WWE when his contract expired on the 8th of February 2007 and subsequently spent a short time at Memphis Wrestling. He returned to the WWE as the Big Show almost a year later, where he stayed for the following 13 years, making his final WWE appearance on the 4th of January 2021. The following month, White signed with All Elite Wrestling, where he remains to this day. Returning to the bench press on the 29th of January 2018, Paul posted the following video to his Instagram, that shows him pressing four plates per side on a counterbalanced Smith machine, for a combined weight of 170 kilograms, or 375 pounds. His form and range of motion are very impressive, but taking into account Paul's age and weight loss, please leave a comment below letting me know whether you believe that he could bench press 500 pounds for 12 repetitions during his prime. The final example of Paul's strength is his bicep curl with 61 kilograms or 135 pounds for seven reps with clearly more left in the tank. That brings me towards the end of the video, but I've left credit, social media links and a link for ExpressVPN in the description below, so please check those out and give them a follow. And finally, if you enjoyed the video, please help to support the YouTube algorithm by smashing like, sharing the video, and if you haven't done so already, by subscribing. Thank you.